Uh, do you remember the first time you met Thijs? If I remember, I will always remember. He's my only <laughs> friend I had from Holland. When I was lost, I was young, I was confused. I really didn't have anybody in Holland. I got these journalists that reached out to me. And uh, in that time, the journalists, they were, they were not my friends. They were opposite, my enemies. And he reached out and, um, and uh, we met for a dinner, lunch, let's say. And from there, we became really good friends. We played tennis, we, we met, he helped me a lot. He gave me all the support I needed. And, uh, and uh, that was a step uh, in my first step in my career. So I even wrote about Tice in my book. Uh, I was very thankful for everything, and we still keep in contact. And uh, and he, he went straight in my heart from that moment. And Thais, I have only I only want to say that I love you, my friend. Yeah. Ah, so nice. Yeah, it's emotional, of course. <laughs> and, uh, and I really appreciate everything. Uh, everything. Uh, that I went through with Thais because I get to know, he get to know the person Zlatan and I get to know the person Thais. So it was not about football, it was not about journalism or something like that. It was it was all about friendship. He, he reached out to a lost little boy that I think he wanted good and he and he, he just wanted to help and he, he, he showed who he was and he demonstrated by, by his actions. So I can say that I'm here also because of ties. Of course. Yeah, my friend, I uh, really appreciate it, of course. And I, I cherish the moments uh, yeah, we, we had through all the years. And yeah, we, had, we had some great fun. And it was a different time in, in football, in, in, in journalism also. Yeah, uh, after training, uh, I went to his house. That's that, that's that, that's not normal when you, in, 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 if you talk about now. And um, it was always uh, about um, yeah, we had a lot of fun. We, um, for example, um, uh, a football player in that time they trained in the morning and in the afternoon. A lot of times they were they were they were free, and he was alone most of the time in in, in Dime. Dime Zuid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dime Noord, what was it? Dime Noord. Noord, Dime Noord. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, and, um, and yeah, we, 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 we were young, and, and what we will do, yeah, we, then yeah, did do, do you play tennis, for example? Who won? Now, that, that's a good story. Um, <laughs> uh, I was uh, playing tennis uh, since I was, I think, 12 or something. And uh, I thought I was quite good. Um, and he never played tennis before he came to Holland. Really? And the first game we played, uh, I won the first set. And after that, I never won one set anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I think his, his, his uh, eyeball coordination was a little bit better than mine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you had some dinners at yeah, the game? Yeah, now that's what we, what we did when if if I uh, won a, a game or a set, then I had to choose where we uh, ate. And I always want to eat Eitsmeiter eggs eh, in the Amsterdam, and he yeah, wanted yeah, to go yeah. and, he, and he wanted to go to the fucking IKEA with. Uh, <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> 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 And, and they yeah, had, uh, the intelligent people. They and there in Ikea, they had uh, the, the meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> the meatballs with the cranberry sauce. Oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah. But, but also, but later on, when we were a little bit established, we went to a Cinema Paradiso, and uh, that was better, huh? Yes. Yeah, that was better. Huh? But uh, at that time, um, uh, uh, football players, they, they, they were, there was no social media and stuff. And uh, there was one time we had an, we had an auction uh, for my amateur club mm. in, uh, in Hazel, where I was grown. Uh, there were some problems there with, uh, with finance and they need to, they did a, um, a gala evening. Yeah. And one of the, the prices was go to the McDonald's 
uh, weet Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Dat is een spijker of Ajax. En het was in een in, in, in sportsbar in de village. En er was iemand die 3500 euro to go with, the, to, with him and me to the McDonald's. <laughs> and and uh, he said, yeah, it's no problem, I'll do it. <laughs> and so I went with three girls from, uh, from Asia. They were, they were, I think they were 12, 13, and 15. Mm -hmm. Totally crazy about Ajax and about the, the striker. Yeah. I went in the car to, uh, to Amsterdam and we, we ate with the McDonald's. Oh. And, uh, and, and, uh, that, that's unbelievable. Cool. Thing, you know. He talks a lot, Slaton. <laughs> No, no, no. He that's times oh. when he talks, yeah. people listen. So I'm very happy to hear his voice. Yeah. Yes. Has he ever tried to talk you over for a move to PSV? <laughs> no, <I> no, <laughs> no, no, no. We never, we never discuss. Actually, <laughs> Tais is the one that presented me to Mino Raiola also, mm. and uh, he he helped me with that and. Uh, Like I said, I did understand a lot about the football world, and and he was like, I have two options for you. Either you go with the Beckham company from London, but I think they're too nice. I need, I think you should go with the Mafia Mino. That fits you better. <laughs> Good move. <laughs> and, and from there, I started to work with Mino. So, yeah. like I said, he gave me a push in my early age career, and. Uh, No, he doesn't talk a lot. When he when he talks, he listens. He has his experience, and, and he wants wants the best out of me. And that I noticed very early, and that's why we were hanging hanging out all the time. So, and it's not easy for a young boy come from a different country. You come as a guest. You don't know the tradition. There was a lot of pressure on me. I could not speak the language. I didn't understand about the game. So a helping hand was there, and the, his name was Ty. So I have only only one thing to say, and that's thanks. So I'm very thankful, and, and that's why I said I will always remember it. Yeah, we are searching for blood donor. Are you a blood donor? Say that so. Yeah, that's the word. But I don't think that it's good for a professional athlete to to uh, to give blood. I think it's better for after the career when he's retired. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. Thank you so much you. and good luck tomorrow. Thank you. Thais, I love you. you I'll speak. see you around. We keep in touch. Yes, my Say friend. Say hello to family. Yeah, I will. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.